Chapter 23, Admirals Nagumo and Kusaka on the bridge of the Akaika, December 6, 1941. It won't work. Look, said Joe, even if he remembers the worm while we're at Shea, he can't get one. Where's anyone going to find a worm at Shea Stadium? Don't worry, we'll say. You've won. We'll find a worm after we get home. And we keep right on stuffing them. Peanuts, hot dogs, hamburgers, Cracker Jack, ice cream, orange soda, gum, Mars bars. You know how he loves to eat. You ever seen him refuse something to eat? By the time we start home, he'll be bloated, drowsy, belching. Remember the last time when his father took us? He was asleep by the time we hit Pisco. Your father would carry him from the car. His mother and father put him to bed. Next morning, he'll wake up too late. You've won. Fifteen worms, fifteen days. He missed a day. Alan nodded his thumbnail. What about Tom? We'll ask him along and then just not pick him up. We can tell your father and Billy that Tom's mother called. He was sick. His grandmother died. Anything. Just so we don't have to bring him with us. Alan sighed. Jeez, it probably cost me eight dollars just to buy all that food. Cracker Jack, hamburgers. Yeah, but it'll cost you fifty dollars if he wins. Yeah, well, oh, jeez. How'd I ever get into this? My father finds out. Alan slumped on the porch steps, gazing down at his sneakers, gnawing on his thumbnail. Come on, said Joe, slapping him on the shoulder. Cheer up. You haven't lost yet. Go ask your father.